Everything technology, from computers to mobile phones, TVs and the internet. Information you want, all the help you need. Your Tech Life with Trevor Long. Welcome to Your Tech Life, I'm Trevor Long. If you're like me and you sit in front of the TV sometimes with your iPad or your phone and you're looking at the Twitter streams on different TV shows, I've got an iPad app here for you that brings that all together with a program guide and a Twitter stream all in one. It's called Twelevision. Okay, Twelevision is essentially a Twitter app, but it's not really for tweeting, it's for reading tweets. So this is meant to be a companion app to watching live TV. So right now, uh, the Moto GP is live here, uh, where I'm recording from, and so this is now downloading an EPG. So down here, we'll see all the channels listed, and then over here, they'll show the tweets relevant to the TV shows on at the moment. Okay, so we've got our channel listing downloaded. So now you can see uh, it's just a scrollable channel list. And if I tap 1, 1 HD, the uh, Formula 1 channel, <laughs> as I like to call it. But uh, right now is the MotoGP. So this is live EPG data. Uh, and it's, it's got an automatic hashtag for the program, which is showing over here in the, um, in the Twitter screen. Um, I can refresh that by pulling down with very all the uh, useful uh, standard iPad gestures. I can send a new tweet with the hashtag automatic there. You can refresh uh, that way as well. Uh, this is a uh, this is my personal Twitter view, which is quite useful. Um, but so you can actually use this as a Twitter client essentially. All right. But most importantly, it's a companion device, a companion app for your live television. So here are tweets coming through right now about the MotoGP. Now over on uh, other channels, so on SBS, the Eurovision Song Contest. So if we click on that, uh, you'll see Eurovision Song Contest tweets. Now, importantly, and this is a good example, Eurovision isn't live on SBS, and so we may see old tweets there. So I can turn that one off, and I can add in my own hashtag, SBS Eurovision, and add that, and that will now appear over here. Okay? So these are tweets with that hashtag. Another example of that, and if we uh, double tap on here, on, on a channel, it'll show you... Uh, the full ch channel lineup for that uh, channel. Uh, I, can't, I'm not gonna, not, I can't go forward to uh, to a, a weeknight, but I I noticed that uh, a current affair had a, a hashtag a current affair, and the the general hashtag for ACA is ACA. So that's something that you can add in here on your own as you like. And uh, in fact, the television people on Twitter um, are looking at those, and they'll update those as they go along. Um, you'll find some that are pretty pretty weird hashtags. Me, myself, and Irene. I guess, well, look, there's a lot of people talking about it. 60-minute um, makeover on 7.2. You know, there's tw people are tweeting about everything that's on, on television, and this really does prove it. So it's a great little way to interact. Obviously, big programs like Q&A, fantastic way to interact with um, with the television uh, and and other viewers of the TV show you're watching. And the only thing I would say is that what a wonderful thing would be to integrate live TV into here using, for example, the El, uh, Elgato uh, TV app. Uh, so I've got an Elgato uh, net stream, which uh, streams live TV across my network, and I can actually watch live TV here on the iPad. I'll do a separate review of this, uh, but you can see here uh, all the live TV channels. So I could now go into this and actually watch 60 Minute Maker from on 7.2 uh, right here on the iPad, and imagine if that was actually part of the window there for television. That's kind of I guess the next step that you might be able to make. And there we go, live television right here on the iPad. Uh, and you can actually swipe to change channels, which is really useful. I'm in a very bad digital reception area, so I can't get all the channels. Um, but yeah, swipe to change channel. And if you integrate it with your whole network, you can also record and all these kind of things. So very, very cool um, live TV app. And what I was thinking was, uh, what a great way to integrate that app into television, maybe even just a very small screen down here of the uh, of the live vision, uh, if those two apps work together. Great stuff, and that is a simple little app called Twelevision.